You can also add in count that is countdown on your shortcut projects. So to generate out a uh, count, you need to click on open other right here. And over here, you can see count is an option. And once you click on this here, you can go around and select the defaults. And here you can see you can select the direction up or down according to what you want to generate. And style is second. You can also go for style frame or time code or clock if you wish to and select out the sound that you want to actually generate out as well. So let me just go around right here and the background will be clock right here and duration can be set as well. So let me just press OK and you can see that this is what it generated. So you can press the play button and then what happens is that it'll play. So right now the duration is only uh, one frame. So let me just go around and set the duration to 10 seconds right here. So now if I were to press the play button, You can see the countdown right here. So you can go around right here and set the, uh, to, it to frame zero or click on no background as well. So you can see the sound changes out according to the frame and the style is second. You can also go for frames. And you can see that it uh, counts as per the frame right here. And then you can go for direction and background will be clock right here. And you can see it is according to the frame now. So direction is up right now, so direction down. And you can see the changes according to uh, what you set. So you can go for silent over here on sound. You can go for time code as well. So it's according to the time code now or clock right here. So that is how you can um, add in count uh, that is generate out count and you can bring that out in the timeline as well. So hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.